welcome back to our brewery farm life. We have been working super hard these last few weeks getting ready for winter. It's coming whether we want it to or not, so we have to make sure that we're ready. The weather of course is a lot different today than it has been for the last few weeks with the beautiful sunshine that we had and it's definitely taking its toll on me because everyone knows I'm not a big fan of the winter. It's like my least favorite time of the year. I hate the snow. It's snowing. But it's definitely been a productive few weeks. So stay tuned, check it out. Looks like the boss is waiting for me to get to work and I'm a little bit late. Morning, Arthur. A smart person would mark where the trusses are. <laughs> Do you want me to comment on that? Working on the farm trying to get things done um, ready for winter it's never fun but we noticed with the rain this year that it's not draining properly down the hill where we have the uh, packaging area so we're just trying to get that cleaned up for the season and it's pretty funny watching David play had a big rain last night and David's work has paid off. The swale has worked. Happy Sunday! So we're getting ready to put up the field fence that will go around and keep our animals in. You're supposed to be in the pasture. Do you hear me? That. You. No. Pardon me? Did she just stick her tongue out at you? Yep. Haha, <laughs> -ha, I will uh, distract him by scratching my ears. Yo. Okay, I won't, I promise. The end of it's right here, Red. Thanks, Jack. <laughs> you helping? Yeah, where's he going? Keep an eye on him. A busy day as usual on the farm. We had uh, a crew come in. They wanted to have their Christmas flyer done up with some professional photog photography in the cow pen so they had pictures done with the cows and we're still working on cleanup but we're making it and hopefully we'll be ready for winter. Is that a nice new spot? House for the goats. Who would have thought? Thanks Dave. Some neighbors down the road and regulars were over on the weekend and he was looking at the pasture and said hey, I've got something for you guys you need to come and pick it up. So we took a break today and we drove over to his place and we picked up something for the goats. It's pretty fun. So now the goats have a new place to hang out. Isn't that fun? Right now they don't look interested, but they will. I guess the moral of the story is, make hay when the sun shines and get as much done as you can get done on such beautiful days like this. One of my favorite parts of living in the country, nighttime barn chores, is that beautiful sky.
So there you have it. If you liked what you saw, make sure to subscribe, like, and we'll talk to you next week.